And to remind yourself what God says, I have seen. Take back this verse and spend the next week reflecting on this, I have seen. And if you think that, yes, God, I want to turn my eyes to you, transform me, change me, make a transaction with God right now. If you know that you are not living your life right, and you know that everything is open before God and under the gaze of the Almighty, Holy, Omnipresent, Omniscient God, would you just make the transaction with Him right now and say, God, I choose to turn away from this habit. I choose to turn away from this practice. And I choose to turn my eyes to You. As the eyes of the slaves turn to their master, as the eyes of the maid servant turns to their, their, their maiden, I turn my eyes to you. God, would you come and transform and change me? Would you do just that? i just give you a few moments before we sing the closing song, The Power of His Love. And be assured of this. If we confess our sins, it's faithful and just to forgive us of our sins and cleanse us from all our unrighteousness. Be assured of this, that the God of love will come and embrace you, the power of His love. And God's promise to you is that underneath is His everlasting arms of love for you and for me. Would you just make a transaction with God right now before I pray for you?
Proverbs chapter 4, verse 20, it says, My son, give attention to my words. Incline your ears to my saying. Do not let them depart from your sight. Keep them in the midst of your heart, for they are life to those who find them, and health to all their whole body. Let's receive the Lord's benediction. And now may the love, the love of God be above you to overshadow you, beneath you to uphold you, before you to guide you, behind you to protect you, close beside you and within you to make you able for all things and to reward your faithfulness with the joy and peace which the world cannot give, neither can it take it away. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, to whom be all glory now and forevermore. Amen. The Lord bless you.